There's one thing you need to know about the Ring of Fire. It produces 90% of the world's earthquakes. The Ring of Fire includes about 450 volcanoes. Many of them are submarine volcanoes, meaning they're underwater, as are 75% of the world's volcanoes in total. Now, the Ring of Fire is also called the Circum-Pacific Belt. It's a result of plate tectonics. The movement of the plates has created a nearly continuous series of oceanic trenches and chains of volcanoes stretching for 25,000 miles in a horseshoe-shaped pattern from New Zealand past Japan, across the Bering Strait, and down toward the tip of South America. The plate movement also causes earthquakes. Because many of these earthquakes occur in the ocean, the Ring of Fire is also known for tsunamis, produced when the ocean floor is either forced to rise or fall. When a megathrust event happens in this region, the water is displaced and the water pushes ashore. Most tsunamis are only a few inches high, but there are times that that wave and that swell can be as tall as buildings.